Okay, soaps and such. I just wanted to talk a little bit about our makeup brushes or the proper makeup brushes that you should use for minimal makeup. They should be made out of some type of animal hair such as goat hair, uh, badger hair, um, one of those types of um, hairs because they're able to disperse the minerals better than synthetic brushes. I always thought it was a bunch of hogwash until I tested both of them and I always stick with a goat hair type of brush or a badger hair type of brush for my mineral makeup. It picks them up and disperses them better than synthetics. So I just want to go briefly go over each one of the brushes that I use every day. This one first is for the foundation powder and you'll notice that it looks like a little mushroom. Okay, so that's called the Kabuki brush and I use that for my base mineral makeup because again, um, and I go push down on it and I go round, 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 round. So it's good to have a kabuki brush to apply your base mineral makeup. Then this one I use for, you see the blush on there and see how it's at an angle. It's similar to this one we sell in the store. Um, but again, it's at an angle and I like that for my blush because then I just go dot, dot and I just pull it up a little bit and pull it up a little bit in a roundy motion. If you just pull it up straight, it's gonna look like a triangle and you don't want that. So I use an angular brush like this for my blush. Then this next one here, you see it's kind of flat. See how it's different from the Kabuki? This one's flat, this one's like a mushroom. So what I use this for is for um, my finishing powder that we make here at Soaps and Such. And that just puts the finishing touches on it. And again, tap, tap, tap. You put this all over your face, even over your blush. And that just gives a blending type of uh, finishing to your face. And then this is what I use. As you know, we make awesome eyeshadows. You should check them out. They're all over our mirror here too. Okay, so those are all for sale, as the sign says. We call them iPods. So this is the one that I like for mine because it's an angular one again. And notice that it's still those boar hair bristles, or bad boar badger, or goat hair. Those are the three. But it's at an angle, and I like that because when I put on my makeup, it allows me to get way into those creases with those angles. And the awesome thing about our makeup is that it doesn't crease because it's treated with cannabis-treated sericite which makes ours different from anything else out there and better than anything out there because it resists creasing, allows your, hair, your um, face to breathe, and your pores to breathe as well. So just wanted to go over those brushes for you so you know what to look for. We also do have a kit available. I believe it's about, let me see, it's about $24.99.